हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू अचीवर्स अड्डा गाइस इफ यू आर फर्स्ट टाइम इन दिस चैनल प्लीज डू सब्सक्राइब टू दिस चैनल एंड डू नॉट फॉरगेट टू हिट अ लाइक बटन एंड प्रेस द बेल आइकॉन फॉर अपकमिंग नोटिफिकेशन ऑन द वीडियोस एंड लाइव सेशन डेली मॉर्निंग आई एम टेकिंग ए यूजीसी नेट पेपर 1 डेली 1 डेटा इंटरप्रिटेशन एंड फाइव मैथमेटिकल एप्टीट्यूड क्वेश्चंस इन दिस YouTube चैनल प्लीज डू सब्सक्राइब सो दैट यू विल गेट अपडेटेड दैट इज टारगेट 20 बाय 20 मार्क्स इज गोइंग ऑन एंड डेली एट अ 5 पीएम इन एन एकेडमी फ्री प्लेटफार्म माय फ्री लाइव सेशंस आर गोइंग ऑन यू कैन कैच मी अप by going through with the link given in the description and do not forget to join in my telegram group achiever sadda aa the link is available in the description as well as in the chat box you can just join over there and get all the updates use the invite code shiva live to unlock the free live sessions at an academy free platform and same code will be used for getting a 10 percentage discount on the an academy plus subscription for my complete courses for the paper 1 and paper 2 ugc net exam so guys uh, this video is about the complete three shifts of ugc net commerce 2021 all the three shifts whatever 300 questions are there subject wise analysis i have done how many questions from each of the topic now which topic is to be given more importance at this last point of time so let us try to go through with that analysis so that i will be concluding some points which is useful for your preparation and important areas also i am going to give it please do watch the video till the end so let us try and move further by <coughs> if you can see the total three shifts of commerce these are the total ugc net commerce all the three shifts of 2021 examination shift 1 shift 2 shift 3 total 300 questions hai na bhai 100 100 100 we know very well now out of this 100 100 100 there are 10 units business environment international business accounting and auditing economics finance statistics hrm and management and banking and financial institutions marketing legal aspects of business income tax and corporate tax planning you carefully observe in the shift number 1 b and ib <clears throat> 10 questions given separately and there is a five questions based reading comprehension is also given from the b and ib total 15 question means 30 marks coverage have been done in the b and ib unit number 1 itself you carefully observe in the shift number 2 also same number of 10 questions and 15 the five number of questions of reading comprehension that shift number 2 also from the b and ib so here rc here rc from the b and ib only and in the shift number 3 also one rc is given which is b and ib only again and here only seven questions individual questions are given you must understand the importance of business environment international business i am telling you again and again because i covered extensively in the academy plus platform because of this reason only there is a much 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 important uh, uh, with respect to b and ib 42 questions have been asked actually 30 questions is a maximum one that we can usually expect but there are 42 questions look at the number 5 plus 5 plus 5 3 15 questions extra apart from the normal individual question reading comprehension is there so we need to understand the international business and business environment so that we can answer that reading comprehension also because reading comprehension we can't prepare by ourselves don't know from where they will give the reading comprehension by directly seeing in the exam we should apply our prior knowledge if anything or the data given in the comprehension only we can able to solve we are having only previous year question to solve there are no other questions is possible from this chapter right uh, with regard to reading comprehension next next come for this second unit if you look into the second unit very carefully nine individual questions in the shift number 1 five this five is a surprise data interpretation is given that is on standard costing ha na bhai that variance analysis overhead variance is given standard costing that is five surprise question asking us to identify the calendar variance and variable overhead variance fixed overhead variance capacity variance those five questions were given total 14 and shift 2 and 3 very easy 10 10 questions were given out of that 8 by 8 8 by 8 you are able to solve it because one partnership one amalgamation valuation of shares mixed version so out of 30 34 questions are given next third which is most important economics now as of now shift number 1 seven questions only shift number 2 9 and shift number 3 seven but actually usually the importance for this the importance for this business economics is previously more 
if you carefully observe previously it was more more number of questions from the economics but this time only 23 number of clear cut questions are given individual questions because by in the economics looking like more number of questions but i clarified i cla i classified in such a way with a clarity of the overlapping chapters also so after removing the overlapping 23 clear number of questions are available next a business finance most scoring area for the practical uh, liking students those are those are unit number 2 and 4 nine questions from the shift number 1 eight in the shift number 2 eight in the shift number 3 so on an average nine questions you can expect uh, pakka damn sure from here and if possible they will give more number of questions also pakka areas will be there like a cost of capital one question dividend model one question capital budgeting two or one question like that clear cut and capital structure also one or two questions even leasing one question like that pakka areas are coming in the business finance in all the shifts same trend is repeated from the all area like whatever the expected areas like a working capital management inventory management and uh, uh, cash management as well as in the capital budgeting techniques of NPV and IRR in comparison of those both. And if you look at the ARR, average rate of return question also been asked. Some exceptional question one or two will be pakka because you cannot expect all the question the, there are like arbitrage pricing theory we have not, uh, we have not expected previously but this time they have given. So like that you can there are surprise questions also will be there but if you are able to handle the normal questions then you are very near to the cutoff exceptional questions you have to do on the day of exam then if you are getting out of it then you will be under the zone of jrf also next a business statistics business statistics always this is important for the ug senate exam both for the paper one and paper two point of view nine questions given 10 and 10 so minimum 30 questions you can expect over here so uh, whether shift one or shift two shift three business statistics is equally most 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 important like a b and ib as of now i can categorize this fifth and uh, first unit under the a category a category units and bmhrm is also i would say this is a star category b and ib and bmhrm look at 10 number of question 10 number of question 12 here 7 plus 5 the one data the our reading comprehension have been given total 32 questions have been asked right so banking and financial institution which is 8 question 7 question 13 question here shift number 3 total 5 uh, reading comprehension based questions are there and 8 and 7 minimum to minimum come say come 8 question but previous trend was 14 questions were there from the banking there are 13 question and there are 12 questions in the banking there are scenarios so you cannot take the light of the banking and financial institution most important unit and easily you can get the marks because i will tell you the very exact areas rbi one question pakka that is monetary policy fiscal policy related or monetary policy instruments related and credit rating agencies one question insurance related one question is always coming non-banking financial institution one question is coming capital and money market uh, relationship based and uh, difference based one question is always coming and if you can look into the types of bank the commercial banks and their limit and the private banks that related one question is coming and there is always a regular question which is linking with the economy is always been asked previously 2020 Atmanirbar Bharat have been linked with the Indian economy that they have asked in the financial markets as well uh, they have asked in the uh, banking chapter and in the uh, recent time they, they, there is a question which is related to COVID-19 and technology linking with the banking and internet banking related one question is damn sure you can expect. So I am telling just orally if you can count this number of question it is coming around 8 to 9 or 10 questions it will come. So, after understanding a three units topic wise basis, you will get this much proper knowledge what to study, what to eliminate from your revision. So, give more importance to this utmost areas which are being keep on repeating in each, each of the chapter. Next, uh, marketing management, here of the all the units after the B and IB, I can tell you uh, that uh, marketing management because marketing management always a minimum number of questions pakka. This time 9 and 9 here 11 is given. But always you can expect a minimum 10 questions from the marketing management. Very easy area. Segmentation one questioning. Product life cycle one questioning. Or else position or targeting one question. And logistic management one question. Even new trends of marketing one question always. And uh, that BCG matrix, the, all the matrix are there. Now one question that is coming. And uh, if you look at uh, this... Uh,
the stages of product new product development the stages of new product development one question is always coming and moreover if you can go for in detail consumer behavior related models and the the whatever the ada models and other models are there one question is guaranteed from there so each of the area there is a one guaranteed portion which will be always repeating in the examination that is marketing management right and legal aspects of business you can see legal aspects of business eight questions nine question ten questions they are giving more importance to contract act even gst also asked contract act two to three questions were asked negotiable instrument one question sale of goods act one question ipr two to three questions were there most important act this time is that ipr intellectual property right and uh, competition act these two are given more importance this time i don't know why but uh, you have to cover the penalties and contravention in each of the act whether it is contract act or whether it is uh, ipr or a consumer uh, the competition act it could be anything you must give the importance to those areas which are penalties and contraventions right next income tax and corporate tax planning this is always a minimum guaranteed unit minimum guaranteed unit 10 10 11 means pakka damn sure areas residential status one question or a person definition residential status or a person definition either of the one question and income from salary either a one or two questions guaranteed either it is from the deductions or else normal provision of the this one and exemption based either a provident fund exemption or either 10 one agriculture exemption based one question is there income from business and profession two or one questions always coming income from house property sequence based this time two questions were there income from capital gain exemption based one question was there and itr filing sequence got asked even uh, deductions related multiple questions were asked deduction mass the following in every shift it is there and even tds related percentages have been asked and uh, advanced tax due date also been asked uh, the due dates for the advanced tax whether it is self-assessment or else uh, other SSEs also and even income from the other sources gambling betting all these questions got asked so there are damn sure areas which you can expect from the income tax and tax uh, corporate tax planning I already explained almost majority things are covered in the Unacademy Plus platform. In the free platform also, I try to cover some things so which are beneficial for you. If you can keep this analysis in mind, this will be giving you more strength over what to prepare, what to eliminate in your revision. Remember this elimination, whoever do the proper elimination of the revision, the, those people are going to have a high chance of success because reading irrelevant areas are not required our target is not to get 100 by 100 questions correct our target is to get maximum possible number of questions to get it correct out of 100 that is target should be more than 70 questions so that our jrf will be in our hand with a surety otherwise with a possibility only right all the best guys if you like this analysis if you like this video if you are expecting more number of videos like this do not forget to hit the like button to appreciate the effort please do hit the bell icon and do share it with your friends ask them to subscribe to this channel till that time will uh, bye bye we'll be meeting in the next video thank you so much